Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Kozna Creations, another exciting tutorial. And in this tutorial, you'll be learning how to create a pillow. To begin with the tutorial now, first let's take a poly cube and increase its width and depth according to our pillow size. So mine would be somewhere around like 11 to 20, I guess. Yeah, and I would also like to increase the subdivision width to around 10 and also the subdivision depth up to 10 and also the height up to 2 okay now that we have the basic structure we don't really have to model each and everything because there are quite a few steps which make our life easier so first to do that let's go to the FX tab if you're using the old version of Maya for example maybe 2016 or the older versions you might really have to go to and dynamics or dynamics there now let's go to fx here and go to end cloth and create end cloth this object has been turned into end cloth here and if you just go to the attribute editors here just go to end cloth shape one and here you can see pressure just go to pressure and you can see the pressure option which is zero here and what happens if we bump up this value let's say i would bump this up to like what 0.5 let's see what's gonna happen see what you have to do here is hit play and then pause it when the pillow gets inflated so for example if you just hit play and pause it see that's how it works but this is not completely inflated it doesn't look really inflated because it's quite the pressure is quite less so let's get back and increase the pressure here so I would bump it up to like one now and Let's play and pause it now. Okay, this looks better than the previous one. Okay, now that the pillow is inflated with one, if you hit three on your keyboard, you can actually see the shape of the pillow here. And you don't really have to do anything else, but there is one quite important step here, which you definitely have to do it. Click on the pillow and go to edit and delete by type history because previously it was an end cloth and now it's a polygon it's not an end cloth now so and this is pretty much how you create pillow in quite easy steps without modeling each and everything and that's it for the tutorial guys if you do have any questions please comment down below and i'll revert back as soon as possible thank you so much until next time bye